Hello everyone, this is Mahali from Cloud Pages, and in today's video, I'll be showing you how you can enable breadcrumbs using Rank Math plugin. So, guys, you need breadcrumbs basically to navigate back to your home page from your current page that you're currently working on. Uh, it has many benefits. For example, number one, it will give the user a much better experience. Number two, it will have a much lower bounce rate. And number three, for search engine bots, um, and it will provide an easier crawling, which will improve the overall SEO ranking. So, guys, before you guys just enable your breadcrumbs you have to be careful of two th uh, two things number one you have to choose a theme which is very much seo friendly number two you have to choose a theme uh, you have to choose either a theme crumble uh, cr uh, breadcrumbs options or a plugin option you guys cannot do both of them so without further ado let's just go straight to the video Okay guys, so let's start with the video. We are going to modify uh, the function PHP file. Okay, so to do so, first of all, we have to have a rank math plugin. So let's install that. Click on plugins, click on add new. From here, search for rank math. We're gonna go and install the one with 1 million plus active installations. And once it's installed, you have to click on activate okay as you guys can see once i activate my plugin automatically you will see rank math tab right over here okay guys so once you are done with that you have your rank math plugin all installed you have to enable uh, breadcrumbs in your rank math so go in rank math click on general settings from here you have to select breadcrumbs and once you open this tab you will be able to see this little toggle okay if you see the toggle like this and the screen like this you have to turn it on you have to enable your breadcrumb functions once you do that you will see all of these options all ready for you so once you turn on this toggle click on save changes and you have enabled it within rank math okay so now we're going to modify our function.php file to do so click on appearance from here click on theme editor and before we do anything let me just give you a little warning all of these files are basically the backbone of your wordpress site do not mess with them unless you're absolutely sure of the code that you're putting or the code that you're deleting since every little change will have an impact on your wordpress site okay so after that warning let's just continue with function.php which is right over here once you click on it scroll down and this is where we are going to enter our code enter so this is the code that you guys have to enter this little one copy it paste it over here don't worry i'll mention it in the description box click on update file once you are done you have successfully modified your file so what if you want to make more changes in the appearance or more changes in the outlook of uh, breadcrumbs so to do so just go in appearance click on customize and once you go there click on additional css and this is the code that you have to enter in additional css uh, don't worry i will also mention this one in the description you will only add this if you want to increase the changes that you want to do so so once you do that just click on publish and you are done with it you have successfully added breadcrumbs to your wordpress site so you guys can see it is so simple so easy all you have to be careful is of the fact that the code that you're putting uh, is correct with syntax with commands they are very much accurate and you're not messing up with the other files or other commands within uh, the function the dot php files so uh, this is it for today if you still have any questions just drop a question in the comment section and please subscribe and like cloud pages thank you